FNN. The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here. This is the Tiger Financial News Network 10 a.m. market update on this 25th Wednesday, 25th of May. We're looking at the Dow up a little bit, up four points at 31,935. After the early weakness, it's good to see a little bit of green here, but in fact, the Dow needs to get clear 32,118. That's the 14 period exponential moving average. It's at 31,941 right now. It needs to do that and it needs to do it fairly soon to say that this particular low that was made on the 20th and 30,635 at least has some upside capability, whether or not it goes, uh, even it hasn't yet gone to a buy signal, but if it goes from a buy signal to a buy mode, it can go all the way to the 32,500s. Let's do one step at a time. Support today at 31,800 is absolutely imperative to keep. The S&P, at this particular point, the S&P is up uh, five at 39.46, not anywhere close as good as the uh, Dow. It needs to clear its nine, the pink nine period moving average of 39.50, uh, 66, and it needs to do it fairly soon and needs to try to get by Thursday, maybe Friday, somewhere in the 4,030, 39.90s to 4,005 area. That'll be good action. So far, it's just okay. The QQQs are still very weak. They're up, uh, they're unchanged at 287 really struggling you haven't seen anything decent here for them to actually show that there's real upside capability in this particular phase of the market you need to see 297 298 and yeah, there are 10 points lower than that or 12 points lower than that the iwm russell 2000 is uh within a little bit of a range it's up one at 176.68 not bad not bad we're looking at gold i haven't looked at gold yet gold is down Eight and 19 at 1846. Remember, we're looking at the GDX in my show yesterday, the Tiger Technicians Hour coming up straight after this news, and it's at 32.34. It's doing okay, but it's really not showing the acceleration up that it should. If you're looking at crude oil, still very strong. It's up 83 cents at 110.60. This is an area we're going to see either it goes sideways or if it breaks out to the 113 area, hmm, that's going to be a big deal. TLT bonds, our bonds are down. I'll be back in a moment for the Tiger Technicians Hour. Hope you can join me. Check out my opening call, David Newsletter. Be back in a moment. 